Oslo Metal Saldana Steelworks in the Western Cape served as a pilot site for the Industrial Energy Efficiency Project managed by the National Cleaner Production Centre of South Africa. The introduction and implementation of an energy management system at the plant took place after then energy manager Raynette van Sael attended the first phase of the IEE project's expert level training. Looking at this plant situation in 2010, beginning in 2011, we were facing um, closure because of high co cost. We focused on the export market, so we had to do something. The commitment is critical. Understanding your, the opportunities and the potential of your plant. Is this the best way to do it? Can we do this in another way? And then awareness and education is a critical part for sustained savings. One of the key uh, the foundations and the key tenets of the project is energy management system implementation. Mm -hmm. When we conducted our first round of energy management system expert training, mm -hmm. Rarette Van Zell came along and joined the group. Mm -hmm. And it's from that course that our UNIDO trainers started to realize just the potential within ArcelorMittal mm -hmm. by a sheer fact of its size. I was going to ask you what, what makes a successful energy project? An energy project is, there is one that starts with a commitment from the top down. Mm. This is not something you implement at middle management or lower management levels. Mm. You need top management commitment because you're going to need the resources from them. In Arsler Middle, mm. we were blessed with Desson Moodley having had the, the foresight mm. to support Renet in this initiative. Mm. And that enabled us to ultimately unlock the opportunities. Mm. The interventions at the plant required an investment of a mere 500,000 rand that led to gross financial savings of more than 89.6 million within the first year, being 2011. By the end of June 2013, the value of energy savings had reached a staggering 176 million rand, and it is estimated that the savings realised will account for 362 million by the year 2016. Examples of interventions include reducing the use of fans and pumps, maintaining the temperature of the water cooling system, preventing unnecessary use of burners, and reducing the consumption of liquid petroleum gas, or LPG. On a visit to the plant, IEE project donors were pleased by the results achieved. What uh, we are supporting here is the improvement of energy efficiency. Uh, it's a, an environmental uh, objective which is at the core of uh, Switzerland foreign policy. Mm. And as one of the funders, the impact that was uh, presented to you, are you satisfied so far? Yes, the results are clear, they are decisive, they've been uh, reached uh, with a relatively cheap investment, but at the same time, I understand, reala realize, how complex the implementation is and how skillful the management, the workforce, must be to realise these objectives. The National Cleaner Production Centre of South Africa is a programme of government and is committed to contributing to the objectives of, amongst others, the Industrial Policy Action Plan and the National Energy Efficiency Strategy. It is hosted by the CSIR on behalf of the Department of Trade and Industry. With the rapid increases in the cost of energy we've seen over the last couple of years, the pressure on our economy because of our very high carbon intensity. We're very excited about this kind of project because it reduces the energy requirements on the grid, it reduces the energy requirements of the company, it makes this industry more competitive and it also makes a massive contribution to our greenhouse gas emissions.